Today we're learning how to make this four-step roadmap in PowerPoint with the different color variations. Let's start from a blank slide and add a shape and half a circle. Drag it on the screen and you can position it at the bottom of the page if you want to make sure it's straight. So you can grab the handle and make sure it matches the bottom of the slide. Position it in the middle, remove the outline and make a copy. Turn it 180 degrees and position it so it matches the previous one. Select both and copy them again and match them on the other side. Center everything in the middle of the page and union. Now create a little circle to round off the edges. Remove the outline and do it on the other side as well. And then merge all the shapes together. Right click format shape and we're going to put a gradient on top of it. So gradient fill and we're going to form a red to a blue. So let's make it red and add some gradient stops in between and slightly go to purple and then blue eventually. And then all the way to the right is going to be light and then align the gradient from left to right. So it's a nice transition of colors. Play around a bit with the intervals and make sure they spread evenly. And that looks nice. Right click format background and we're going to create a slightly gray background. So remove the colors that we've previously used and make a light gray tone on the background. And now we're going to add the stops. So add a circle, make it white without an outline and center it in one of the curves. Format shape and add a drop shadow. A drop shadow from the center so it's evenly on all sides. Play around with transparency, increase the blur a little bit and then copy it three more times. Now we want to add a text box for the number. So number one, font is Montserrat. Increase the font size, make it bold and then copy it to three and four. Change the colors so they match the gradient from the roadmap and then add a title, add a text box with some dummy text, reduce the font size and use a dark gray. So not a completely black, black font, but let's go for a dark gray one. Copy it a few times so they match the different steps. Remove maybe the title to the bottom there for number two and four. Position it in the center and this is a slide which we are looking for. Now let's create some variations. So right click duplicate the slide and right click on the background, format background and go for some darker tones. So from dark gray to a little bit lighter gray. Then of course we want to change the text to so the color of the text. We want to make it white. And now we're going to duplicate once more and change the gradient to one single color. So format shape and then change the colors from dark red to a lighter red, almost a pink. Do the same for the numbers and then do the same in different colors, for example, blue or purple, whatever you want. So you can really play around to customize it. Now I'm going to show you a trick. So if you go to design tab, slides, and then go to the colors and change the color settings of your presentation, you can instantly change the colors to your brand guidelines or to any colors that you like. There's a lot of presets available. You can also customize them. So I would advise to customize some colors and you can always use your color palette. And this way you can really quickly change the style of your presentations. Let's preview. Now you know how to make this nice four step roadmap in PowerPoint and customize it to your needs. Thanks a lot for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and hope to see you in the next video.